Yes, we didn't stay on the way, we didn't have to sleep on the road. We made it to Firenze. Critico Mass is an international event which takes place in more than 500 cities around the world, normally each last Friday of each month, where cyclists spontaneously and in mass go riding through the streets of their city, usually busy with cars. It concentrates on the right to use the streets as an alternative way of commuting and not only as a simple car storage. It also focuses on the currently deterioration of quality of life, starting from air and acoustic pollution levels created by engines. Today, there are critical mass in many cities in the world and it is always different because it varies in size, traffic laws, and police and drivers' response from city to city. The critical mass is an idea, an event, an attitude. There is no leader and no organization. It is simply made of people joining the right and there is no official route to follow. The route is absolutely casual and decided right there by the movement of the mass. Every cyclist follow the person in front of you and anyone can make yourself in the front. Therefore, no one really deviates from the route making a solid mess. The critical mess is an extended concept that becomes particularly ingenious when applied to the bicycle. A critical mess of bikes overturns the concept of traffic. Critical mass does not block traffic. Critical mass is traffic. It is interesting to say that the event recommends avoiding verbal and physical abuse between cyclists and auto drivers. The event promotes cycling, so it's better let it be. Moreover, the critical mass is not a protest, but a planned coincidence. Therefore, if anyone feels like bringing along a flag in order to bring attention to a movement, avoid conflict, which is annoying and will delay the mass. Nevertheless, the critical mass has no rules. You do whatever you want. Everything the event recommends is no more than suggestions. That being said, there is also each year the interplanetary critical mass also known as Chimona. The Chiamona is a great critical mass, the largest imaginable. It is an annual coincidence of cyclists that transforms a normal critical mass into a vortex of pedaling fun for three days. 
The interplanetary critical mass turned 15 years old this year and is still happily roaming across Italy. After being held for 11 years in Rome, Ciemona made its way to Milan, Bologna and Bari. We arrived in Florence on the exact day that Ciemona had first arrived in Florence. But what does Ciemona exactly mean? Well, it is the abbreviation of the letters C and M in Italian. C pronounced CI and M pronounced M. Saying together makes it C and Mona. C and Mona literally means big C and M or big critical mass. When the number of bicycles goes beyond imagination, when the roaring of sound of motorized traffic is just a far removed memory, when you are surrounded by cyclists as far as the eye can see, when you discover the streets as beautiful as you've never seen before, well then, Jimona has arrived. Too bright! <laughs> All right! So, after spending this awesome day yesterday at the critical mass, uh, we're going to explore a bit of Firenze today. Yes! So, Firenze, uh, when you arrived here, I already like it so much because it's such a beautiful city. But uh, the first thing everybody sees when you arrive in Florence, Florence, Firenze, you know. It's Whatever the, you want. It's the Ponte Vecchia <laughs> right there at the back of us. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. <laughs> our new friend. Ciao. We are making a video for our channel. Ciao. <laughs> Everybody's face as well. So yeah, you know, um, Italy is amazing. What really got my attention is that uh, there are people doing sports here, kayaking and people running along the river. I I wouldn't expect that from from such a big city like this mix of nature and uh, metropolitan and cosmopolitan <laughs> <laughs> yeah so you see apparently he got he has everything you know it has like a bit of everything so yeah. i love when i arrived in the city and i have the feeling i could live here and this yes, is the type of place yes definitely we actually be looking mm, i definitely could live in that house mm. i definitely could live in this part of town <laughs> yeah well so let's explore more of florence and see everything that we can do in one day Come with us. So we were about to leave Firenze, Florence, and we knew it was going to rain, but in the city center it has this sign saying protection like a civil protection, strong thunder wall, strong strong hard to do the translation. Yeah. So uh, civil protection, alert to Florence. Strong storm from midday to midnight today. Now it's so ye yellow code, yellow code risk, yellow code risk. It's kind of scary now, eh? Yeah, let's go fast. yeah we gotta go fast. 